Hola amigos, welcome back to my channel. This is my second last week in Antigua, Guatemala. I haven't explored much because I had to go to school in the morning and it usually rained in the afternoon. So I decided to take a break from school and do some filming and editing for these two weeks. For editing, I like to go to a cafe. So when the battery dies on my computer, I know it's time to stop looking at my computer and go to take a walk. In Antigua, there are so many nice cafes. I need to find one that has a reasonable size and also has Wi-Fi. So I'm able to sit there and work for a few hours. Since I will be visiting different cafes in these two weeks anyways, I think I better film it and show you guys as well. If you are a digital nomad or you need to work online occasionally, I hope this video can help. So let's go. The first one is Cafe Ferrando. At the entrance, there's only a small bar table. Coffee every morning. But if you go inside, there's a selection of local products such as coffee and cacao. Go a bit further, that's the cafe. I like it there because there's enough sunlight and fresh air. The most important thing is, Misha is here. Sometimes she likes to play, sometimes she just likes her a long time under the sun. Coffee every morning and whiskey every night. Blow the candles out and think about my life. How did I get here and where am I going? He's a beautiful man, but I know that I don't love him. The only way I can survive is coffee every morning and whiskey every night. Coffee every morning and whiskey every night. Stuck in this routine, but it doesn't feel like mine. A mix of pain and pleasure. When everything feels wrong And I can only ask myself to be so strong The second one is Union Cafe It has beautiful wall painting with Chinese film The indoor setting is a little dark And I prefer to sit outside if the weather is good This menu has a wide selection for different diets. You can find bulletproof coffee and vegan pancake here. Chai tea is quite popular in Antigua. Since I don't drink coffee, it gives me another option. Besides, the waitress is very kind and friendly, which makes me to visit a few more times. Coffee every morning and whiskey every night. Another day is here and I've given up this fight. I need to change the weather. Or a change in the tides for I can find a light. The third one is called the Bagel Bar. Its name clearly states itself. Bagel promotion is on every weekday, which you can get a free coffee or a smoothie by purchasing a bagel. For cream cheese, there are a few flavors to choose from. This is the bacon cream cheese. It's a great place if you're great for bagel, but the place is a little dark for work. Coffee every morning. Next is a very local cozy cafe called the Cafe La Palada. I like to sit by the window to have the sunlight and look at the local sea. Food and drink are delicious with a reasonable price. It's a great place to have breakfast. The last one is Bella Vista Coffee. It's located on the third floor of a building. I think it's the only cafe in Antigua that has a magnificent view. 
It's a great place to clear the mind and organize the future. The food is not bad, but the ladies work there always look miserable. Yeah, I went there a few times, and I had never seen a smiling face. Well, nothing is perfect. Just look at the view. The last time around. I made a lot of half-hearted mistakes, but I worked so hard on this one. Gave her my the above are the cafes that I visited in Antigua. Which one you like the most? Leave me a comment down below. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. Until next time, bye. Every new heartbreak hurts a little more.